How to use test generator? How you can add your school or institute and create student batches? Add your school or institute. Although you can use test generator without adding your school or institute, but this feature gives you more power to use it efficiently. If you are sharing an open link with your students, it can be shared with anyone. But if you are doing it through batch format, you can control the access to your link. Means no one else will be able to view the quiz. Here you can print and save results batch wise. It means if the same quiz is shared with 10A, 10B, 10C, still you can get separate reports for each section or batch. Soon you will be able to add your videos, assignments and worksheets with your students using this feature. The best part of this feature is that it gives you a permanent link to share with all the batches. So you need not to share new quiz link each time. Another fascinating feature is that you will get a PWA mobile app with your name and logo. Your students will get an option to install your mobile app while they open your institute page link and next time they will simply open the app to attempt the test. No need to log in each time you share the link. It's saved forever. Let's understand the process. Let's open my CBC guide test generator and go to this uh, my institute block. Here the first thing is add institute name. Here you will add your school or institute. Just click add and give a name to your institute. You can change the domain name anytime but you must share the new link with your student as the previous link will stop working. The second thing is there should be no gap between the words. So it is the subdomain for your school or institute. Let's take A, B, C, school. Then add logo of the school or institute. Let's put this logo. You can just click this, add it and change the logo as required. Click confirm. Then write your institute name and address. Be careful that this domain name should be short and simple so that the student can remember it. This is the copy link. You can just click it. It is copied and let's open it in new page to see how my institute is looking now. Yeah, this is the institute page link that you will share with your students. Let's go back. Now add batches. It is the second step. Click add and click add batch. You can write anything as batch name here but if you are a school we suggest to write class and section as batches like 10A and then 10B then 10C. This way you can create any number of batches. In next video, we will discuss how you can add students to the batches.